Welcome then, ladies and gentlemen, to Subnautica Below Zero Penguins! That is part of the name. That is part of the name. Subnautica Below Zero Penguins. It's crazy how the world just has these weirdly shaped like snow mountains in the shape of letters. I really thought you were like, whoa, look at those weird snow mountains. And I was about to hit you with the most like sarcastic, it's a glacier. And then you went with letters and I was like, oh, I see. <laughs> <laughs> Ooh, like, snow oh, mountain. It's a weird snow mountain. What crazy the alien, snow, snow alien mountain geography. Weird. I mean, this is already uh, quite a difference from Subnautica's the, loading these, screen. These like penguin looking things. Is there, uh, is there, are there like, pardon my, my language, but are there beaks erect? Uh, one, yes. Two, look at the back right one when it opens its beak. <laughs> Oh, what the God, fuck is in yeah. there? What is in there? What type of tendrils are sitting inside of your head? Is that a beak? Is it, is it, is, is it like a deployment of a weapon? <laughs> it's so kind of freaky, actually. My biggest question here is, what are they saying? Look at the small one. My best parental figure. Ha <laughs> <laughs> ha, fall again, child. I do not wish to ignore your other parental figure. I will. I will ignore him. And and stand stand here. You can fall over if you want. I can. That's excellent. Wait, forty five, forty six B. Oh yeah, is it the same the planet? Death of, the death of your the death of your sister. This feels like spoilers. I'm yeah, wait, no, I didn't even read that last part. <laughs> Investigate the death of your sister. Oh my god. Okay, this is this is us, Robin. We're not a silent protagonist anymore. Excuse me? Uh, uh, what what the fuck is this? This is so, this so different, different instantly! <laughs> what are we this doing? So Why are we like heroing our way down to yeah, What is right happening? <laughs> Why is what are we there like Armageddon occurring? What are we piloting and why are we following that, that fucking asteroid to the surface? Approaching 45, why are we following the asteroid? <laughs> yeah, what did you what, think that's, would that's, happen? That's, exact, that's what was always going to fucking happen! Drop. Asteroids what? break up in the atmosphere! You're a oh, space what? traveler! <laughs> You're literally traveling through space! You should know this! So we are a Robin, and we just crashed on... Oh. I guess like a glacial area of 45, 46B. We also lost our escape pod because of that, so it's somewhere. Oh, what is we're dead. happening? Oh, is Oh, I thought we were about to die, and it was gonna be, this is the sister who died. And then it restarts. <laughs> You know, honestly, it was her own fault. Like, did you see how she tried to approach this planet? Why do we have half a food meter? Why didn't we eat before we launched? <laughs> yeah, why didn't we have a nice lunch before we pulled off this mission? Is that a temperature meter that is constantly going down? Oh, yeah, there's, a, there's an extra one. Okay, I have to imagine we need to find the life pod. There's a fucking meteor storm still happening. What happens if it gets to below zero? <laughs> Also, we're in the middle of a landmass. I didn't even register me, but you register me. You didn't make bread on so, my- Sorry, th there's a nutrient block on the floor, so I understand why you said bread, and that's why I wanted you to pick it up. <laughs> you didn't even make bread, man. Block. You didn't even- I'm just, there's so many things happening that aren't the same. Well, I'm going to eat the nutrient bar is what I'm going to do, so that's cool. Okay, excellent. excellent. <laughs> wow, it was really good. Oh, this is so neat. Trees? Trees? Okay. I feel like this temperature bar is going to become a big issue, so we need to find like yeah, this either feels shelter like an or the light new thing to manage. I'm just gonna. Oh wait, if you get near the, the thing, yeah, yeah, okay, yeah, because yeah, 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 it's a fire. Look at me, yeah. I'm a clever clogs. My okay. my shoes have brains. So my my assumptions based on this immediate thing is land is going to be an active part of this game, but they didn't want you to just free travel land, so it's like a land O2 meter. Yeah, but I have a feeling we're gonna be able to craft. Yeah, like yeah, there will be there will be warm warm wet suit, which actually sounds really bad when I phrase it like warm that. Warm it's a warm wet suit. Yeah, whoa, 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 whoa. Okay. I don't like the look of that. Okay. Did they not go as planned? Because you followed a meteorite, motherfucker! Like, I understand the concept of being in an asteroid storm because you don't want to be seen, but I don't think you need to be, like, like two, two cars distance is correct following oh, procedure. It's a hot, hot just, like, flower. Oh. It's like a See, radiator. It, like... it literally is a radiator oh flower. God. Like, it just what switches on and just... Mm. Take my warm human. That has gone immediately from being creepy to being a good friend. I don't it's just like, oh Whoa. god, don't get too close to it apparently. Okay, alright, okay. Nice of them to like create an objective path with these hot things along the way. 
Is it is it weird that I'm immediately unsettled by the the beacon marker being orange instead of blue? Yeah, that is that is it's, it's, uh, it's, uh, But I assume it's because obviously Arctic area, a lot more blue stuff. Who would have guessed below zero would involve? I feel like water is going to be bad if we don't like the temperature on land. No, 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 d- d- buddy, buddy, you already had it correct. You just needed to end that sentence with "I feel like water is going to be bad." Understandable, but like I just, I feel really, like if you get need water, to... it's going to be an immediate to... issue. Does it want me to? So go I feel in? like it wants you to travel across like the, the 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 ice. Oh, you know, I really thought with how much like training and exposure and bravery and exploration I'd mustered and done and conquered as I left in a glorious rocket, I would come into below zero, dive in like a dolphin man, and slap every fish I could see. But immediately, I'm having overwhelming existential dread at a new unknown. Well, I, I, am, I think I'm I'm okay. a coward, Connor. <laughs> well, I understand where you're at. I think we actually probably want to travel on the little patches of ice that are floating, rather than. I agree. You know what? I completely agree with you. You do need like, to. Well, while I not. while I like ex- while I like exploration, I have a significant feeling the second you touch the water in an Arctic region, that temperature bar is going to fucking dive. Yeah, I feel like big step one is solve. Like, th- there has to be a heated like outfit of some description, right? Like, you you would think. I think we intended to land in this area, even if we missed a little bit. Ah, ah, ah. And if that is the case... Ultra drain, one second. No, it went back up? Okay, so it's... Oh, no, I'm going up! The water's warm! The water's warm. Oh, the water's warm! This brings secondary questions, because we're on the same planet as the first game. But the first game was entirely locked in a volcano. I assume this isn't if it's glaciers. Yeah, this must be like... Martin! Oh, Martin's here. Oh, oh you oh, came I guess to meet us! Oh, right, I guess that's how you know it's the same planet. I mean, we, we left him in a time capsule. He must have just wound yeah, up in the Arctic. Yeah, he must have got launched over here! He, I don't think he likes it up here. Martin, tell us the, tell us what's going on. What's happening? What is this place? What year is it, Martin? It's cold. Put me back. <laughs> Shut up, Martin. I need your wisdom. What is this torrential wind? <laughs> this is awful, isn't it? Look how cold it is. Fish don't belong at Blizzard! <laughs> yeah, this is probably awful for you now that I think about it. Please go back in! No, 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 man. You just go in my pocket now. <laughs> See, I'm interested by that, because, like, th- the reason I brought up the whole volcano thing was, like, that could explain why water warm, but water shouldn't be, like, the sun. This doesn't make sense to me. Hey, guys. Oh, they are actually quite big. They are. They're reasonably sized. Oh, they're they're, they don't seem to like sharing it with you. Pick up Pengling? <laughs> <laughs> One of them fell over. Oh, is that one mad that you're taking its child? Oh, yeah, God! Child. Oh, I'm so sorry! I'm so you sorry! Child. I'm so sorry! I stole, stole your baby! Keep the child down. <laughs> what? You're sorry, you're walking away with it. I'm so sorry! I picked up your baby! Don't drown the baby! Look at them! Also, why does it have so many eyes? And you're drowning the baby. <laughs> I just needed some, you know, a little, little bit of a... A little bit of a... <laughs> you just, you've kidnapped this child and started drowning it. I'm sure they, they don't know. Oh, look at them go! They're doing proper penguin things! They're very penguish. Oh, I'm so excited and dreadful to have new areas to explore. Should I put down the child? Well, I mean, either put him down or take him all the way to the life pod. Those are the two choices. Did he just sneeze? Why is there music playing? I don't like that it was quiet. There was, like, no no music, and then you got to right here, and it was like, we're going to play some slightly ominous tones. Why would you even point that out? You know, I was blissfully unaware. My ears were shut. One one thing that we got used to, of course, was, like, once we... Oh! Oh, no, we can't just... Okay. He's just a one... He's just a one! He's not, like, a little... Like, right. I thought it was just, like, oh, you can hold him or put him down. No, uh, he's just ours now. Okay. Ooh, was this new? This bladderfish, yeah? You oh, but it looks... It just updated look, I Why guess. Why do I hold it by its head? Well, I imagine the sides are very, very fragile, but also you're touching its eye. <laughs> That's so fucked up! Give it to a penguin. Feed it to him. This is recompense for your child. <laughs> he did! He ate it! He just ate it! Congratulations, we will now take this child. <laughs> you can't just rob all the penguin children! Why can I just take all of the penguin children? They seem pretty oh. upset about it, if I'll be honest with you. Guys! Guys, look, don't worry. Don't worry. Look, we, we will take good care of all of our penguins. We're going to release all of them in the escape pod. I hear something that sounds whale-like. But I have no idea how close or far it is. Uh, maybe the, maybe there is reef back still? Like it, it sounds like that type of creature, but it doesn't sound quite the same. I have to imagine it won't be like a dangerous big thing at this, at this early juncture. Oh. Okay, that's even more ridiculous than the hatch. Oh, it's like a starter base. 
I'm sorry about your sister. I don't like the picture of her face. God, that's so mean! Like, maybe it is, but... She does look, though, a bit weird. <laughs> yeah, like, it's just like... Like, I... I... It's like somebody was playing it. around with character creation sliders and just they, they got a little too far and they didn't know how to fix it. <laughs> it's one of those character creators where you can drag around the face. Yeah. It's like, <laughs> let's make the eyes a bit further apart than they maybe should be. Let's let's give her a really rock, rock hard jaw. Oh, her surname is Bench. Fucking Lillian Bench. I like how before they said the I'm sorry about the, your sister, they said, your sister is dead from her own negligence. That seems unlikely to me. Yeah, I mean, given that we're investigating sister death, I assume we believe that it wasn't, like, what they say it is, and that's why we're here. This is, like, so different. And, like, not to be mean to this person and their sister, but it feels like it's such a smaller scale type of thing than the first game so far. <laughs> Not to be like mean unless this, I just mean I just mean sister. unless it turns out to us saving an entire alien planet and eradicating a deadly disease, I, I feel like this is a much smaller mystery. Did you make a robot penguin. I think that was our sister. So she's found something big, and Altera's like, nope, no, you didn't. That doesn't exist. So you know, I I, I yeah. smell cover up murder is what I'm uh -huh. what I'm got what I got a whiff of you know a big old scent of. Uh, but I'm interested in how that's going to somehow lead us deeper into the water, as I would expect the game will progress. I assume we have to find whatever her robot penguin scout found and that might be deep well we're probably gonna find the robot penguin scout i feel we? like we're immediately like reaching and trying to apply endgame subnautica to the very start of below zero and that might lead us astray <laughs> we found a frozen leviathan that's infected with Kara. ah they want Kara. yeah okay so they want to harvest Kara and use it as a bioweapon because of course they do bloody corporations but also how was i guess it, i guess it was a frozen leviathan that's in fact that's insane yeah i was about to say how is it still infected i assume it was infected it, it died and was frozen and still infected because obviously it was an ice. Yeah, like time. it's incubated inside it. Yeah. Hope I wrecked him, but I don't think I am anyway, miss. So okay, so she's found the, the, the thing, she knows that they want to weaponize it and they've like removed her to stop her I to think, stop it getting out. I, I know what you said about applying in game subnautica logic, but I can't help but feel like the whole the whole goal is going to be finding this creature, um, defreezing it and also curing it. <laughs> in almost in sea emperor like fashion. Maybe it just is a sea emperor. It could be. It's possible. Oh, maybe it's one of those three million year old skeletons. Oh no 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 no. You're talking to yourself, Robin. You don't need to tell us to do that. All right, we're That's... looking for a radio tower. That's so interesting. Let me. Oh, can I? Yeah, we're... I think we. Can I release it? Yeah, just release them in the life pod, of course. Oh. Can't put the penguin in this open space. Please shove it in a storage locker. Please instead. put it in the closet. Okay, so we get to start with a base. That's quite fun. We have a knife? If we don't have a knife, I feel like we need that sooner rather than Yeah, later. we don't have a knife. We've got to start, you know, the the usual... Old grabby way. Well, I guess get grabby. Oh, here we are again. Oh, my God. Oh. oh, oh. Yeah, we will. We'll use a lot of that, actually. Galena. Oh, Galena Ooh. outcrop. That's lead. A Similar lead, though. Similar lead. I guess it makes sense. I mean... The materials are all going to be the same materials, right? Because they're just actual elements. Yeah, that's true. Also, we are still on the same planet. Oxygen. So nothing too fancy. Oh, yeah, oxygen. God, Jesus, we don't while. have a tank anymore. It's been anymore. a while. It's been a while. Oh, God. Oh, God. Okay. 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 Why is it orange? Yeah, that's a little bit horrifying, actually. Oh, dangerous weather. Seek shelter. I assume underwater is shelter. Oh, my God. You can see it like... We can see, like, hail pouring into the ocean little bits at a time. Oh, yeah, that's so cool. It's fucking awesome. <laughs> I'm going to assume, and I might be wrong to assume this, because they might subvert expectations. Oh, energy storage plants. Okay. They're new ribbon plants. Yeah. The, the initial areas of Subnautica were deliberately quite calm, mm -hmm. so you could get your bearings. So I'm going to assume well, this... that there's nothing like... Horrific. Well, well logically speaking, in this in this yeah. in this area, I think logically speaking, the worst thing we'll see is like a stalker type equivalent because big things need space to operate, and this is shallow. It, it may not be the same shallows, but it is a shallow area. I just love how you hold them. Oh, he's such a dumb looking fish. Throw me! I thought you said kill me, not throw kill me. Kill me! <laughs> kill me! Can you not see how sad I am? Kill me! I wonder me. what it looks like on the other side. Does it have eyes in the same place on the other side, or is it gonna only see up? Like I know its its mouth is on the tip, but it looks like its mouth is the sad what? smile in the middle of it. 
Ooh, ooh. Oh, the easy batteries. Oh, batteries different. It's not acid. Well, yeah, I guess it's not. Yeah, because there's no acid plant. mushrooms okay. here. It's too cold for mushrooms. Okay, silicone cold rubber. For those mushrooms. Do we have to find some kelp, or is it also going to be different? Or is it made from something else? Is the question. Scanner, that's useful. Yeah, now we can start investigating things. Right. Ooh, looks updated. Okay, yeah. that's so weird. Yeah, I know. I don't like it. That's I don't like so that. weird. It's Scanning you know at last. In goes the battery and titanium. Out comes the scanner. Like, this is what we're here for. <laughs> what is the point? Why do we exist? We didn't need a third voice. I haven't forgotten about you, but I kind of have to do a little research on the sides. You're already dead, so, you know. Who cares if it takes me no, a bit longer to work out what happened? What, what do you mean? Like, what, what do you? Why? Why? Oh, hey. Like, what, like you're not here for the company. So, what, what? What's the research gaining? I think she just likes research. I love how many different like plants and animals there is already. Oh man, we need we need fins in an O2 tank. We need a knife, which means we need to be able to get silicone rubber without a knife. So you didn't, something... but you didn't look at what the requirement for what it was, which is what I said we should. What to make? It'll probably be rubber. a new plant. Yeah. I feel like we. Oh no, there's there's kelp vine right there. Okay. <laughs> I just looked around like, oh, never mind. Wait. Everybody hold, hold your horses. Right Wait, no, there. there has to be another way, right? Because don't you need a knife to get the, the kelp from the vine? No, no, because you can just grab the, 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 this, the glowy the glowy seeds. Yeah, but the glow se are the glow seeds the rubber? I thought the glow seeds were lubricant, and I thought it was the, the kelp itself. That was They're lubricant rubber. and rubber. The actual plant itself is, is mesh. Oh, they're red now. Well, yeah, I imagine they're a different kind of similar idea. Altera supply cache detected nearby. Yeah, I'll assume that's like a wreck because there obviously wouldn't be wrecks here. I would assume. Oh yeah. What is this? What, that okay? I don't. Uh, oh. Oh, they look like little sea emperor dudes, but like with a with a flat sea bag. Monkey. Sea monkey. Oh, they're really cute. Oh. Hey. <gasps> what? What? Hey, monkeys, monkey what? Sea what is monkey. happening? What? It took your scanner. What the fuck? It took your fucking scanner. Give me my scanner back. Well, shit. I have Moment of is it about to kill me? And then it then it nicked the scanner. No, I respect that. And interestingly, positionally, we've started seeing them in the kelp area. Does that make them the stalker equivalents? I feel like it does, but instead of like farming metal and biting you, they, they just take you. They, they mug you. And you know, I do like being mugged. Like I had this little heart attack moment when a little like grab. He wants. He's gonna take. He's just rubbing his hands together like, oh yeah, oh that's some good stuff. What is that? That's a good question. Doesn't look like it's really moving. Is it a fish? I can't tell if it's a fish or a plant. Titan, Titan whole, whole fish. fish. <laughs> oh my oh, god! Oh the eye. That's the back of it that we were looking at. Oh my god! It's just like no. I want to scan the Titan whole fish. Give me the. Thank you. Now I know more about my friends. Oxygen. Give me the. Oh my god. Oh my, oh you my god. Oh my god. You little shit. He knows we can't breathe. We are genuinely going to die at some point because of this. We we already are. Oh, you yeah. know what it is. We literally are oh, going are to right die now. because of that. That's incredible. I so annoyed! I tell you what I need. A knife. I know what I'm gonna use it on. A sea monkey. How, I love that they're actually, like, at this stage, they are more dangerous than stalkers were to yeah, us, genuinely, realistically. Genuinely, like, haha, you can either have your scatter, or you can suffocate. Well, I guess it's just don't walk around with things in your hands unless you're ready ready for a chase. I really wanted to finish scanning the Titan whole fish. What an incredible creation. Yeah, it was really cool. Let's just take the circle fish and make it really big. You know what's just occurred to me? If you keep going around with the knife, can the sea monkey steal, steal your the knife? knife and then, and then stop it just. You. Yeah! 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 yeah. Now. <laughs> <laughs> One thing I do want to test. Now give me all the rest of your stuff! <laughs> yeah! <laughs> what have I done? Hey, sea monkey. Do you want a penguin? No, don't do it. Do you want a. Oh my do you god! Want a penguin? Do you want a little? Oh, I don't think he wants a penguin. Oh! I can't give likes. the sea monkey a baby penguin. That would have been hilarious. <laughs> what a what a awesome like clever little creature to to put yeah, at the start. It's, really it's an cool. entirely different threat. You know, I guess it's quotes. like it, yeah, it's like it's like showing off that they they've added new new AI new mechanics. Like check this out, it's a whole new world. Monkeys can grab shit out of your hands. <laughs> That's crazy. That would never happen in real life. So if they ever do another Subnautica, will we be back on this planet again? Oh. This one's not like a numbered sequel. So I, I you can sort of see it as like a, almost like a, a, a side expansion type thing. Yeah. So I feel like if they do another like numbered title, that would be a different planet, right? That would, that makes sense to me. In the first one we crashed and didn't expect to be here, but this woman came to this planet and expected to well, be here. It... So where is all of her gear? Where is her oxygen tank? Where are her flippers? Like what? Well, that's, that's what I'm, that's what I'm saying. It all just feels so weird with the context of this. 
Because, like, she just should have been, like, she literally showed up on half a food bar. Like, just eat the food before you leave. Eat the food before bring, you bring leave. Bring anything with you in your inventory. All right. Flip has achieved. Crystalline sulfur for a repair tool? Uh, it must be more common now. <laughs> nope, you have to get to equivalent, like, Bone River level to get your first repair tool. I mean, I guess that would explain why the water is warmer if there is just cave sulfur around. We just need more tools then, so we do need the repair tool, yeah. but it's not like that unlocks anything. Pipes we don't care about. Okay, yeah, we just need to find I mean, more I guess materials. We, we and don't really more need recipes, the, so the repair let's go tool. To, let's... It's not really a priority, is Actually, it? Because we have nothing point. to repair. Will there be sea moths and cyclops and stuff for new? Vehicles? I feel like eventually, yes, but I just mean uh, maybe repair tool shouldn't be our priority while there isn't anything. <laughs> what if we find something that needs repairing? What if we find a wild sea moth and we have to tame it? Oh, is that another whole fish? Yeah, yeah, I'm gonna go over to it. I want to know what it's for. I, I, I should look at look at you know these 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 native creatures. Like, what are you for? What is your purpose? Justify it just looks like your a floaty, existence. Like... Justify your existence. Oh, I'm 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 big. I'm round and and, uh, and you can you, things can swim through me like a checkpoint. Is that the piranha? It's a symbiote. Symbiote. Fucking excuse me. I can pick it up, but also it's. Oh, and then it wriggled out of our hands. Where are you? That's so weird. No like. Small first predator which nests inside the hole of the titan oh. whole fish and defends them at all costs. Found what the purpose of them is. Oh, symbiotes lay their eggs inside of the gills of the titan whole fish. What? The waste left behind is absorbed by the titan, constituting all the nutrients it needs to survive. Sorry, I'm more confused about the line before that. Wouldn't that kill the titan whole fish? I, I mean, I guess not. I guess not, man. Slow, stupid, and delicious. You can't say that and then Aww. give it that face. The Titan Elvish has evolved entirely beyond basic survival mechanisms like speed, <laughs> intelligence, or hunting. It exists in a semi-permanent oh state of unreflective calm, swimming forward Aww. on impulse, fully trusting the complex ecosystem Moisturized. which supports it. <laughs> that you found your spirit animal. It's beautiful. I mean, exists in a state of near calm. They get nutrients because the little guys just deposit nutrients for them. So they just, they just like, I am here. I am so, whole fish. Replenish. Yeah. Oh, you can, you can take their yeah. oxygen. Oh my god. That is a lot of gills. That's so funny. How do you even do? Do you just like suck on it? Like, how do you do that? Yeah, you just suck and put your mouth to it. Oh, sea lion! So there is just, like, Rex, basically? Because that was just, like, deposit. I yeah, that's actually a really good point. There must be. I guess the justification would be people researched this and it just got left behind, but how would you just leave behind a sea glide? I keep slipping into, I know what I'm doing, and then having a crashing yeah. realization of, wait, this is entirely new. I... Is that lightning? I'm going to go on a limb and say this part of the planet is a lot more uh, violent. Hazardous? above the water. Well, to be fair, we, we were barely even on the planet, but that also means that we were in theory at like an elevation before that we're not now. I mean, I want the rest of the sea glide for both the speed and the light. Oxygenally worried at the, okay, we do have space up there. I wasn't sure if we were enclosed. I'm oxygenally worried. Yeah, I'm sure, I'm sure there will likely be parts near the cache. So that's gotta be like an expected location, you know? That would be why we could see it then. Oh, we just get a free nice. beacon. I think our PDA has an accent. Mineral detector. Seems useful. I'm gonna assume it detects minerals. Oh, sick! Free water. I don't know what that is, but I don't, I don't like it. I think it's just a plant. Ah, success! Hey, nice. Now let us go craft our new sea glide. Yeah. Also, don't go around with your scanner out. You never know when a sea monkey will come for you. <laughs> but also, I feel like the knife is a dangerous. Unless, I just, imagine like the the forced animation of when it tries to steal, you just stab it instantly. It's like go away. That's so mean. Well, it's trying to take your stuff, and I'm pretty sure like the main reason you you cut the knife was to okay, stab the okay, sea monkey. Okay, okay, yes, but that's fine in that direction. I do really like the lighting of this game so far. I think that's gonna that's gonna make for some good yeah, stuff. Yeah, it is. It's really nice. I really like this. Yeah, it's quite pleasant. A bit cold for my taste. Very different tone. Oh, is that like deployable solar panels on the side? I assume I assume that the idea is that you don't worry about the power of the of the, of the base because of that. Oh yeah, Sea Glide. I like how you're checking it out while using it. Like that's not how that should work. <laughs> yeah, you should be going all over the place. <laughs> I can't tell if it's easier to get stuff here or we just know what we're doing. Well, I mean, you're definitely less concerned about the shallow Actually, area. Actually, yeah, that's than a you really were. good point. Oh god, I've come so far. 
<laughs> like I, it would have been like five episodes in before I got the C client. It, it was it was pretty slow going to start <laughs> Look, with. Look, man, I'm trying my best to translate the bravery, but there is probably new, big, evil, and scary things out what? there. I'm not complaining about the speed we're going right now. I'm saying you're going a lot faster. Okay, good. Let's see how mineral detector mineral detects. Hundreds. How much stuff does it want us to make in this? Oh, yeah, it's just a handheld scanner. Limestone chunk. I bet you can like swap what it's searching for too. Okay, let's let's make it find something. Maybe it'll just only show up if it's in the right. There you go. Wait, wait. Yeah, there was some of them were going. And it was like giving. Yeah, there you go. Let's say give it. Ah, it's only if you're in range. Yeah. Okay. I feel like just having that on fragment while we search is probably a good idea. Oh, fragment. There we go. Oh, mossy glass. Uh, those sea monkeys want that thing. It's beeping. It's cool. <laughs> we don't need sea monkeys with with the ability to uh, to find minerals. They're coming. Look at them. They're grouping up. They're after you. Oh, it's just another sea glide fact. I mean, I guess it's still useful at this point for the materials. Yeah, it's titanium at this point. I swear to God, buddy. It's not just him. They're really. We've got a small army really stirring cool, up. Right? Like, he's gonna take your knife. He's gonna take your knife. Oh, he actually is gonna take the knife. Stab him. No! no! The knife! Run! Give me the knife. I just like the idea of you let him get away and he slowly learns how to use it and becomes the Sea Monkey King. The Sea Monkey King would have been a very different uh, journey to the... And yes, the Sea Monkey King is a very different vibe from regular Monkey King. Go home, child. You think it knows where its home is? I mean, it did go straight there, didn't it? I think it was just going away from you. I mean, my question is, do we just roam? I guess we do just roam, don't we? Yeah, yeah I guess so. Like, we want, we want to find tech... And that, that's about where we're at right now, right? No, we, we were told we want to look for a radio tower that you should be able to see from the surface from someplace. That, that's like our story. Oh, like. yeah, the radio tower comment. That's a really good point. See, another interesting thought, I guess, is la the idea of the first game was it was like a not really explored planet. So, like, apparently the player was responsible for naming everything. Is that is that still the case? Because people have been here before. Well, I mean, I think it's just, you know, humans have named everything. So that's just the, the name. Yeah, but in the first with. game, from my understanding, it was literally the player. I hope they can't take the sea glide. I think from based on our penguin, I would guess they can't take anything that's two hands. Oh, no, no, no. I know that sound. No, 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 no. <laughs> uh... Oh! Oh, it's crystalline sulfur. That's not... Yeah, now it's what? just crystalline sulfur. Oh, sea monkey nest! Oh, is there like a frag... It looks like there's a tech fragment. Yeah, there's a sea glide fragment Bowl in the sea like structure nest. made of packs and plant the sea monkeys use their... You know, naturally curious, often draw its metallic materials. Yeah, they are, they are. There's the stock room. Reinforce the side. Yeah, there's literally fragments on it because they, they take them. Yeah, you could Yeah, you could have gotten a full sea glide. So there's just a bunch of sea glide fragments on the nest. Oh! I want to see if we can find this radio tower. I mean, there might be, like, a specific direction in, like, the data pad somewhere or something. Ooh, okay. New nest? That looks like different stuff. Vehicle, vehicle bay. bay fragment. That's only one, though. How is that all one? Well, I mean, the mobile vehicle bay is a pretty big thing. And a PDA? One kilometer capital ship. Oh. Aurora, yeah. Um, what I'm looking for is, like, word of a survivor who escaped. I mean, I guess it makes sense this happens after the first one, because they know about Kara now, and they're, like, they're looking to use it and get it. Which they theoretically would have learned from us, probably. Well, we know that Sea Monkey Nest can give us mobile vehicle bay, so that seems like... I a... mean, that if we can get our Seamoth going, or if there's, like, there might be new vehicles like that. Ooh, this area is definitely a lot creepier! Okay, yeah, no, definitely! Yeah, All right, right, definitely! De All okay. right, wow, you've got a okay. big mouth, sir! Who gave a crocodile speed? Brute shark. Okay, okay. Don't turn around suddenly. Don't turn around suddenly. Don't turn around suddenly. Don't turn around. I feel like it just wanted something to eat, and now that it now that it ate that thing, it's fine. Wow. Yeah, that's a creature. Just out of nowhere, right? To start. Oh, okay. We're onto something here. Yeah, that's a bit deeper. Oh, this area is so interesting. Yeah, there's got to be a, a a nice big sea monkey nest around here. <laughs> nice big sea monkey nest. Seems like it's all built around this kelp root thing. Yeah, look, it's like extending. Oh. Like... Oh, this feels like deeper than you're supposed to just swim then. So there's a plant down there, so I guess we could get that and have a look at the lower section. But I don't think we can stay. Oh. 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 Well, that's pretty from the architect, architect artifact. Architect artifact. Architect. All right. It's medic, you shall Is that like the name for the aliens, perhaps? Yeah, the aliens just called architects. Is that? Well, I guess that's what was this hole is for. Unknown dot dot is it Morse code. Why is that happening? I don't like that at all. I don't know Morse code, but that's three of the same letter, I guess. Oh my god. Like well then. 
So there's a 200 meter distress call. I guess that's not too deep. The question is, has it marked okay. it or not? No. My, my guess would have to be it's probably okay. around where we were hearing it. Got more of the kelp root. That seems like a good sign. Has old friend. been in or... Oh no? Yeah, here we no, go. No, no, okay. Well, well, we'll go with this. Nice. Two out of three. Two out of three. Thanks, sea monkeys. I like how plentiful and bright these oxygen plants are, too. It's, it just feels like they've tried to make the early game a bit, like... Yeah, that's what I was saying. It feels like it's a lot more... Faster. ...thought out in that sense. Mm -hmm. Oh, that's that plant's different. Like the thing right in the middle. Oh, yeah, yeah, this. Yeah, that might be the thing that's... Uh, yeah, I think that might... Oh, hydrothermal vent. I think that might be the type of thing that's doing that, uh... Like, geysery thing over there, so maybe being close to them is dangerous. Ooh, okay. Nope, that is literally just a, like, a lava hole. Oh, there's loads of dead fish! That does make sense to me. It's cooked! Free food! Mobile vehicle bay fragment. Mobile vehicle bay fragment! Oh, if I could at least get this before we pass out! There we go! Alright, uh, go, go! Let's find another plant! Keep, if you, I would go forward looking for plant! This plant! This plant! Ah! Okay, okay! Okay! Okay, okay back up! Back up! Back up! Speed. Back up! I can't help but feel like that mountain is important for some reason. Is that penguin floating? I don't think. I think it's more the the blizzard is playing with your eyes, and there's probably a glaze, a little ice platform under it, or maybe it's floating. God, don't you jump in now that I'm close enough to see you're floating. There's a distance on them. They literally fall when you get close. Wait, that's so weird. Gravity is so funky on this planet, man. Oh, I love forty five forty six P so much. No, nothing will ever will ever forty five forty six be the same without it. Oh, that's a lot of stuff. Okay, interesting. And then we need copper wire, table coral, and gold. I believe we have gold in our, uh, our storage. Yes, we do. We need more copper. And then table coral. I've not, I swear I've not seen table coral. Yeah, I'm not sure I have either. Table coral. Table coral. Now you're going back towards. Look, I don't know where I am, all right? Well, you know, we know where the base is, and now we have a compass. I feel like if we're looking for something we haven't seen, the, the the ideal thing to start with is just further away from life pod. Oh, it's our first egg. And our second egg. And our second egg. That one looks like a symbiote, color scheme wise. Oh, yeah, it was this. Frost anemone. Hot, okay. Anemone. Assuming it does something. Oh, wow, food 10, H2O 20. That's some good stuff. That's amazing. And you were scared of it. I wasn't. I don't know what you're talking about. Oh, this is like its whole thing. I see. This is a this is a biome. Yeah, like th those plants are everywhere. This is a... yeah. Okay. I guess it's like an ice cave biome because it's all like enclosed from the top, which makes oxygen a bit trickier. I can't believe we're being walled by table coral. <laughs> I just <laughs> so, you know at no oxygen. point did I ever expect that. Maybe it's like on land for some reason. I don't know. I don't know where it is. All right, so I need to make a note to come back here. Yeah. It does feel like we're being dumb. It feels like we've gone past it like 17 times and everyone's like, seriously? Well, I know what it normally looks like, but it probably just looks different in this game. Ah, ah, yes. It's so small here. Oh, yeah, look, it's just a more advanced material. I here, guess though. that's the idea as we search on walls then. There's more. Okay, 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 oh. Okay. He doesn't do that much damage. I don't think he knows how to use his jaw correctly. It does seem like he's too top heavy. Like, he's just like, yeah. I, I'm just... He just, he could just be still, I, I just got, oh. Like, he's not doing a proper, like, chop. He's just, ah, ah, Please ah. put yourself into my mouth parts. All right, we need some more lubricant. And then we can see what the mobile vehicle bay is all about. Well, I assume it's mobile, which probably Actually, no, we had to find Seamoth fragments. So I, the bay itself doesn't just give us a vehicle. Yeah, we won't be able to do it, but we will be able to see what's there. So there might be new stuff. I just really want to solve more oxygen issues. Yeah. Because I want to explore the ice cave, that. and I want to explore that, like, lava... <laughs> Lava monkey cave. Well, I, I feel like the game wants us to do whatever this radio tower thing is, but we just haven't seen it yeah, yet. Yeah, but we, we, we want to do the radio tower. We want to answer whatever that mysterious signal is, but we have no idea what either is or where either is. So. Well, yeah, I mean, the mysterious signal being 200 meters deep makes it sound like it's going to be difficult unless there's specifically a trail of oxygen plants. The radio tower sounds more achievable if we can find where it is. I wish we had the compass before we had that, that message play so we could at least, like, know where it was. Yeah. Hey. Nice. Let's deploy it. <laughs> this is, yep, this is the environment for uh, it's, uh, vehicle deploying. Oh, the fucking waves as it goes. Oh, I don't know what oh, I expect. Okay. Well, I thought we'd at least be able to see things we couldn't make, but that's just sort of sad. Yeah, that is really, really genuinely sad. Well, we, we, we created that. Well, we've got supplies and stuff, so let's just go try and 
try and explore this this lava cave maybe that seems like a plan. you mean emergency supply cache because it has the same name it had before oh sorry yes let's go explore emergency supply cache i will say i miss like the the calm serenity of the first games just like reading documents and stuff this character just like talking our, our way through the journey is sort of odd to me yeah it is, it's a very it's i don't know if i don't know if i'll adjust to that yeah it's a big shift yeah it, it's like three or four times more from the look of Ooh, it oh that looks interesting Oh my yep. god. Okay. Yeah, it looks very interesting. There's plants around too to help. I wonder how long the refresh is on those. It oh, seems not too bad. Yeah, that's good. Propulsion cannon! Propulsion cannon fragment. Alright, we like that. And we'll always forget we have it. Laser cutter? Laser cutter. Good, good. Oh, I love the sea monkey! Though impl implication of Rex of laser cutter, right? Unless there's like sea monkey nests we have to take Yeah, there must be something that we use it on obviously well in theory we'll probably go to the base that they were at i feel like at some point so maybe there's more bases <gasps> egg funky oh sea monkey egg sea monkey egg this is quite stressful these caves like if you don't find enough flowers no don't let them take it oh are those babies they're smaller right those yeah, are little they do ones look, yeah they do look smaller they're making tiny little noises little squeaks i know they respawn faster than you use it so i feel like it's okay Okay, I can't tell if we finished exploring here or not. I don't... I feel like no, but I... Oh, we've got a beacon. That's exciting. Does that just happen through time, or...? Must be? Because we're not close to it. I mean, maybe getting that beacon message was related to us being in here. Ooh. Oh, that's a bit different. Propulsion cannon. Also oxygen. Oxygen. Oh my god. No. No! Uh, How do we just not notice? Just got distracted. Is that just the one that we put down then? Oh, because because it left our inventory when we died, I assume, and it just literally go... is where we died. Can we go collect it? Maybe. That would be cool. I mean, I feel like we should be able to collect the beacon if it's there. Is this really where we were? Still so far out. I don't think it was, but like at the same time, that's the only way dropped beacon would make sense to me. Oh yeah, look, it's all of our stuff. So I guess you could use that if you if you if you're worried about death and just carry around a beacon. That's amazing. That's useful. I mean, I guess that might also be a thing. So we don't we don't really know. No, yeah, we, we didn't really die much, did we? Where's the signal gone? It's yeah. there. Go through the Titan Hole, fish. Oh. I don't think you can go through it. Can you go through? Well, I want. Oh. oh, you can go through it. Yes, you. Of course you can. I told you they're checkpoints. That's their whole point for living. I wonder how deep and wide below zero is then. I like that it's like an arctic sea. I feel like at least is as low and wide. Okay, that's right. that's different. Yep. Okay, let's maybe uh yep, that's enough. That's a it's <laughs> a, a bit of a guy. Ah, <laughs> that's that's wow, cool. That's yep. A, that's a bit of a, a bit of a dude. You know, maybe I was growing too bold, too comfortable, too quickly, too straight away. What the No, I, I think it was I was an entirely normal looking creature, you know? What was that? It looked completely like a, a thing that you could always. It, it's not, you know, it's not a, it's not a it weird one. It looked terrific, one. right? Like it was just darkness. It was glowing. Glowing things are usually nice, right? Why did we get like a? We got out the water. That, that's the Excuse sound me? of land, I think. That's the sound of land. <laughs> what was that? That seems so massive to be this soon. It was, it was relatively big. I'll give you that. I think it was. Smaller than I don't think it's a leviathan. I think it was a bit bigger than a bone shark, though. So uh, I, I don't I don't blame your seeing that and feeling the way you do. You know, I really just feel like I've been put back in my box. You know, I was like I was really like bold. Well, you did get back in there yourself. <laughs> Shut up. All right then, guys. That uh, that is below zero. Our initial foray, forage, delve, deep dive into what's Darkness? going on here. It's it's the same yet different, you know? It's the It definitely does feel I'm different. I'm glad that didn't crack the glass. It's got familiarities, but it's Yeah, that wouldn't have been good. Oh god! You could have killed our penguin storage. Like if you enjoyed this, subscribe to the bubble bar, consider supporting the future channel on Patreon down below. And until we meet again. A good Bye. Josh, Cotton, and Hollow with the videos Dropping the humor like a hammer on your tippy toes Bringing entertainment on a daily arrangement To take our insanity and turn it into entertainment Yes, I said entertainment twice
to reiterate that it is nice to look into your faces on a mostly daily basis when you let us in your home to so make the whole world a stage is uh goodbye <laughs>